Hey guys, welcome back again to another Tech Guru video. Today we are in Adobe Photoshop and I got another basic Photoshop tip for you guys today. Uh, so let's say you have an image and you want to crop it or you have a part of an image that you would like to crop out. It is a very easy task within Photoshop and I will show you today how to go about doing that. Uh, so the first thing that you'll, you're going to need to do is unlock the image if it is locked. So under the Layers tab here, if you see a lock over here on the right-hand side, just double-click on that layer, and then it says the layer is locked. So what we're going to do now is we're going to unlock that layer by checking on the lock, which is right up here, okay? Uh, once you've unlocked the image, you then can go over and select your Crop Tool, which is right here. It says Crop Tool. Uh, so go ahead and select your Crop Tool. Now, once once you have your crop tool selected, you then want to click and hold and drag over the image where you would like to crop. Now once you do that, it will then give you a selection box in which you can then go back and actually adjust what part of the image you would like to crop. So if I want this image to be cropped about right here, once I have all of the image selected that I want to crop, I then hit the enter key and I now have a cropped image. Now if you crop your image and it is inaccurate or incorrect you can undo that by going up to edit undo crop or you can hit command or control Z on your keyboard and that will then undo the crop. So again guys if you want to crop an image select your crop tool which is right over here and then click and hold and drag down on the image. Once you have the image selected that you want to crop go ahead and click on the enter key and your image is now cropped. So guys this has been a very basic Photoshop tip on how to crop images within Photoshop. If you do have any questions put them in the comment box below. I'll be more than happy to answer them. If this video helped you, click on the little thumbs up button below the video and like the video. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe to my channel for more great info and tutorials like this. And I will see you guys next time.